Claudio has always been there for him. The classic blue Claudio. That's how I usually know it's Shadow on the screen. He's been pretty inconsistent with his presets. I think I see the blue one the most, but sometimes I go pick the vacation one. That back one going under the standing two yeah. from Jack Seven. All right, same. Nice. One perfectly placed, little whiff punish. Yeah, uh, Shadow's move selection with Claudio is very good. Like, very interesting, too. No punish there on the 4 4 4. Oh, oh he tried to spin. Little Minimal. punish on the hop kick. Oh, counter hit, axe kick. Just out of rage. Oh, punch, gets it, spin. But Shadow with the rage of his own, spins it on the rage wrap, gets that full combo. Shadow already in the lead here. Saint I'm trying not to let it bother that first round bother him. Continuing to play as normal. Oh, jump into the up forward three orbital counter hit launcher. Just short of the wall splat, but he's got the starburst. He's got the wall position. He's got the whip punish. Beautiful combo. And the jack combo. Yeah. Shadow always shows me something new with his character every time I see him play. Saint not looking good right now. He knows. Wow, what a bait. Upper into upper. Yeah, boom, he was at, boom. the first one was at the tip range, so he just assumed Shadow's punish, were, punish would whip, so he just threw out another one. See so Saint coming in for a little bit of pokes, then backing out to mid screen. But now he seems to be getting a little bit more aggressive. No backing out once again. Yeah, he's got to keep a lookout for Shadow's Rage Drive right now. Yeah, that's what took the first round. Oh, he missed the one yeah. Claudio with that, you know, kind of different getup kick that can allow that to whip. Yeah, only a couple of characters, only a few characters in the game have that kind of unique spring kick animation. Marduk, Miguel, Paul. And that can avoid the blue fist. Top kick, find the mark. No wall splat again, but he's got the Rage Drive. Getting Saint, a sense of yeah. deja vu here. Yeah, Saint not in a good position right now. He's trying to fight his way out. Man, the Shadow just looks so comfortable. Spends it. Whoa. And Hopkin finds his mark, and that's going to take it for this first match for Shadow. Yeah, Shadow's showing for whatever reason, as you understand the way Saint plays, this is just a weird character matchup, but he always, at least in recent memory, seems to have Saint's number. I'm really surprised Saint is not going to Bob. But he's going to Infinite Stage. Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. Again, ladies and gentlemen, this is the number 18 and 19 ranked TWT finalists on the leaderboard. Both of them trying to without beyond a shadow of a doubt secure their sp spot for the finals in December without a shadow of a doubt nice unintentional <laughs> but it works out yeah, and these two guys uh, you know these two are really interesting players because they play each other a lot they were playing each other yesterday and they're not the type of sandbag when they play each other they really play for real so well, well, that new extension on the back three nice combo there well set. Trade. Put Saint Ray block. Ready with the Saint. Getting closer and closer to elimination here. Yeah, that empowered Starburst forward. One plus two, one plus two. Takes it. Nice punish with the one, one there. Perfect punish. He's a second hit, not a counter hit at least. Yeah. Shadow didn't use that new extension at all in the first game, and now he's showing it twice. Working with a small lead here, kind of chipping away at Shadow's health bar. And Shadow just seems like he's standing in the perfect range to deal with these jack, uh, jack pokes. Yeah, Saint playing a very basic game, hasn't thrown on, you know, Saint usually kind of brings out these uh, uncommon jack moves, but so far not in this set. Man, and Shadow has evened it up already. 13 seconds. He might be in the lead. 13 right. seconds on the board here, 10. 
He's got to pay attention to the time. He's got eight seconds left. He has to do something. He can't back off anymore. I mean, it's one poke away, right? If you get the poke on the two-second mark and then Is run away. It? Yeah. Yes. Just round three. Fight. Game face. Oh. Aiming for the down four two there. Got full cross down four two instead. Both these guys playing so cautiously. Yeah, Saint waiting for the hop kick. He's got the life lead, and now he's content to kind of chill out a little bit. Shadow needs to find a way to get in. Yeah, so far the, the infinite pick kind of helped him out. They can just stay at, at this point on the screen, not worry about having the corner himself. Nice counter hit, gets the boot. Shadow with rage now. Who finishes it? 17 seconds left on the clock. Yeah, Saints just been slowing the pace of this match to a crawl, and it works out. He floats him out of the running two, I believe that yeah. was. Very wow. rare to see. Super risky, too. Fight. Ooh, for that running two. Burn knuckle. Trying to find his way back in. Already had a half-life deficit. Wow, what a read on the down-back one. Gets the low parry. Beautiful combo. Running two gets the star back. Star yes. burst right back. Yeah, still working on a perfect here. Nice punish. Perfect. Interesting punish there. Yeah, down four, three, two. Final frame round. trap back into the down four, three. Fight. Nice block on the hop kick. Beautiful punish. Finally, oh, somebody one punishes one. of one, one. <laughs> Nice, beautiful punish on that down three. Stop pointing at me. Yeah. That little Claudio poke, that down three. It doesn't look like it is, but it is launch punishable. Yeah. It's launch punishable, but uh, if he spaces it correctly, a lot of moves don't reach. Shadow spending the rage drive. He's got Starburst on deck. One good launch which should seal the deal for him. Spends it, though. Okay, so he's... Oh, gets the one launch. Again! Nice. <laughs> Seriously, I feel like I've been waiting since the beginning of Season 2 for a Jack to start punishing with 1-1. One, one. Well, if anyone's going to do it, it's going to be safe. Yeah, but now... I know we're going to see a wall again, and... A big part of Saint's victory there was the fact that he was able to run away, kind of slow down the pacing. He didn't have to worry about getting away from the wall. One of uh, Shadow's biggest strengths is his wall control. Yeah. You have to imagine he's just going to go somewhere with walls. He goes to abandoned temple. Pretty decently sized stage, but the walls are still a factor. And you know what has to be going through Saint's head. He's definitely worried. He knows that this is probably one of the worst matchups he could have had in this position. Yeah. Considering their history. Claudio being confident about the outcome of this match. Punishes. Yeah, again, now that walls are a factor, Saint has to find a way to control the spacing to the yeah. wall. And so he just pushes Shadow towards the wall just with movement in this jackhammer. Oh, it doesn't break the throw block the second it, time. No not. block. Just oh, not enough to kill. Look at the damage. Safe low. And in that position, you don't even have enough time to like tech and low parry it. Yeah, not if your timing is well enough, it'll be too meaty to actually low parry. And you see Saint here. He, now the walls are now the walls are a factor. He's like, okay. If I just go forward, then I don't have to worry about pinning myself down. But the splat loses the, the wall position, but he's slowly trying to move away. Gotta be careful here, though. That race death like that, exactly what I'm talking about. Nice low parry on the sidestep four, and Saint now one round away from moving on. And trying to keep his position in the TWT leaderboard. Well, for down one plus two. Nice small punish there from Shadow. Shadow needs to get something going, but he's got a small life lead in this third round. But Ooh. 
whipping the Shadow. jackhammer, yeah. whipping it down for two, but not in a position to get a whip punish. I think Shadow is like, he's almost like afraid to whip punish these things because he wants to keep on to that decent life lead he has. Yeah, he doesn't want to overextend, make a mistake, and lose. Yeah, but there's only 19 seconds left, and Saint almost impossible to do anything at this point. And yeah, this is what I like about Shadow, his willingness to just run the clock. Yeah, that's like a 50, that's a, by far the longest perfect I've ever seen. Yeah. Nice punish with the down 4 4 there, I like that. Yeah, Shadow's willingness to be calm, such a rare trait in such a young player. Yeah, it's like, I have the life lead, I don't need to deplete your life bar to win. I just need to have more life than you when the clock hits zero. The patience, man. Yeah, it's such a mature way of looking at the game. Same with a small life lead, life lead here, though. Shadow can't afford to be completely complacent. Oh, hot kick is blocked. The 1-1 one, one punish once again. I like Try that Oki with the down jab there. He's the down 4-2, and that might take it for Saint. Yes, GG, Saint! And Saint moves on into...